Once upon a time, in a tranquil village nestled between rolling hills and babbling brooks, there lived a wise and serene Zen master named Master Koji. People from far and wide sought his guidance on matters of the heart, mind, and soul. One day, a young man named Taro approached Master Koji with a heavy heart. His eyes reflected the weight of a burdened soul, and his voice quivered as he spoke, Master Koji, I cannot understand why bad things happen to good people. It feels unjust, and my heart is troubled. Master Koji, with his long white beard and kind eyes, gestured for Taro to sit beside him under the shade of an ancient cherry blossom tree. The air was filled with the sweet scent of blossoms as Master Koji began his tale. In a distant realm, there was a majestic garden tended by the kindest gardener known to all. The flowers in this garden were vibrant, and the trees bore the sweetest fruits. The gardener loved each plant as if it were a dear friend. Yet, in the corner of this beautiful garden, there grew a thorn bush. Taro listened intently as Master Koji continued, One day, a traveler passing through the garden noticed the thorn bush and questioned the gardener, why do you let this ugly thorn bush grow in your splendid garden of beauty? The wise gardener smiled and replied, This thorn bush, though seemingly unremarkable, serves a purpose. It protects the delicate flowers from the wandering animals that might trample upon them. It shields the garden from harm. Master Koji looked deep into Taro's eyes, Life, my dear Taro, is like this garden. It is filled with beauty and joy, but it also holds challenges and thorns. Bad things happen not as a punishment, but as a part of the intricate tapestry of existence. Taro pondered on these words as Master Koji continued, just as the gardener nurtures the entire garden, the universe orchestrates life in ways beyond our comprehension. We may face difficulties, but in the grand scheme of things, they serve a purpose. They mold us, teach us, and guide us toward growth. Taro, Feeling a sense of understanding, asked, but Master Koji, how can we find peace when faced with hardships? How can we embrace the thorns in our lives? The Zen master chuckled softly, ah, my dear Taro, the key lies in acceptance. Accept the thorns as you accept the blossoms. Life is a dance of opposites, and in the acceptance of both joy and sorrow, we find true peace. Master Koji reached down and plucked a cherry blossom handing it to Taro. Hold this delicate flower in your hand. Feel its fragility. Just like the blossom, your heart can endure storms and still bloom with beauty. Taro took the blossom in his hand, his eyes reflecting a newfound understanding. Master Koji continued, Remember, Taro, that every experience, whether pleasant or challenging, contributes to the masterpiece of your life. Embrace it fully, and you will discover the profound wisdom that lies within. As the sun dipped below the horizon, casting a warm glow upon the village, Taro felt a sense of peace he had not known before. Master Koji's words resonated within him, and he realized that life's challenges were not punishments but opportunities for growth. In the embrace of the cherry blossom tree, Taro and Master Koji sat in silence the gentle rustle of leaves whispering the timeless wisdom that transcended the boundaries of understanding. The village slept peacefully, and Taro carried the profound teachings of the Zen master in his heart, ready to face the ebb and flow of life with newfound resilience and acceptance.